so a weekend it's a saturday we've got to catch up with cars later interviewing jesse but a spot of lunch i love this little kitchen on pelham street handmade delicatessen really lovely nice little thing so this is the hockey part of nottingham and i'm gonna um, grab something to eat have a look in ice nine and then go up to the witchy shop Okay, so I've had some lovely lunch. I've had a walk around the contemporary art um, gallery in Nottingham. You can't film in there, sadly. And um, just had a look around um, Ice Nine. And now I'm gonna head over to the uh, Mystic Moon, our local witchy shop. I'm just pulling out of my car park. In fact, I'll take you along for the ride. Okay, so I'm back. Mm. Bought a few little bits. Um, no decks, <laughs> just in case anybody gets excited. I've got more than enough decks at the moment that have arrived, are arriving. And you know, at the moment, I still can't stop working with my Carol Hertz Illuminated uh, for my Marseille, I'm still really working with and connecting with the um tarot noir and also um working with so we can review as part of the collaboration channel the tarot times the hush tarot uh, which we'll be doing on the last monday of this month but bought a few little bits um so some incense because <laughs> Not that I haven't got enough incense with a drawer full of it. But this is some Paolo Santo 
uh, incense, which smells absolutely lovely. In fact, let's light some. Let's, uh, oh, I mean, it's in a little tray. <gasps> wow, look at that. How lovely is that? It's by Tribal Soul. So you take the little bit of rope off. Love the little feather. And I think there are 20 sticks. 12, 12 sticks. Oh, that smells divine. So let's light some of that. Has that taken? Yeah. Lovely. So I'll pop that in this. If I can create the space. There we go. So pop that there. So it smells. Oh, it smells lovely. Nice little set. And that was not expensive. One ninety five, something like that. It's by Tribal Soul. Um, so I bought that. And then I bought this huge piece of sage. I've only got loose sage so far. So I thought, um, oh yes, I'll show that in a second. Um, so I bought three things from the Witch's Moon. This is the main piece and they've wrapped it so well. So you might recall when I went there, a previous time I think it was when I was with Jen Rodriguez when she was over I bought it was I bought this little bowl it's kind of like blue and brown um, and it's got this little sleeping hair with this Celtic design on it and it's got um, little crystal chips inside and I put a tea light in there so it's a tea light holder and it sits on this little uh, wooden bowl on my desk I was looking to see if they had any more because Sandra asked me if I saw one to pick one up for a book they haven't replaced it yet. Well, I did get this for this to go in. And I know lots of people use the Abalong um, shells and I was looking at them, but I wanted a nice big one and they didn't have any. And then I saw this and I thought, wow. So in the same style, with these, there's the moon gazing hair. I just love it. The price is still on the inside. It was twenty two ninety nine, um, which I didn't think was bad because they are handmade. Um, there was a beautiful green goddess in there, um, and I asked how much it was for sale, and she said it's not for sale. It's part of their goddess um, altar that they've got in there, a little sacred space they've created in the shop. But she's taking my details to see if they can get any more. She said they got it from Glastonbury, so if all else fails, I'll pick it up from Glastonbury. But this is gorgeous. So I thought this would be nice to put my uh, smudge. Stir. Probably not, probably still not deep enough. It will be if I rest it against one of the uh, one of the hairs. So I really, really like that. And then the last thing I got um, was this little beauty in the same pottery. But with a goddess on it now there was they didn't have hairs um but they had either a goddess or the triple moon um symbol on there and this is to put um you know pal i'm gonna say palo santo um florida water or well water moon water whatever you want um, and i have got a couple of bottles on my altar glass bottles but I thought this would be nice to sit on my on my desk. Um, so I might put um, Florida water in there for now. But when I go to Glastonbury for the UK Tarot Meetup in August, I'm going to get uh, quite a few bottles of Chalice Well water from Glastonbury um, so that I can top up my bottles and things. So that's my intention for that. But I think that's beautiful. And that was only £8, £7.95. And they're all handmade. Um, and stamped so I thought it was really lovely so they'll go together um, with my little my little tea light holder as a as a set do you know I woke up this morning and I was talking to Kelly Bear 
who's gone off somewhere today with some friends and I thought, Do you know what? I'm not interviewing Jesse until 4 p.m. Um, I've got quite a busy day tomorrow. I've had a few weekends away and I thought it'd be really nice just to take a walk around town. I haven't gone into the towny city parts. I've been into the Bohemian Quarter, around the Lace Market and around um, Hockley, which is quite alternative. And it was really nice. I had some lunch, as I said, in the Contemporary Art Museum. I had a walk around the Art Museum, um, or Art Gallery, I should say. And then just took that drive over to Sherwood um, and had a look around the Mystic Moon. Now, I didn't film in there because there is a sign up saying, please ask for permission um, to use photography. Now, I have had permission in the past, um, and I'll link the video below that I did 18 months ago. And the shop hasn't changed that much at all, really. So do have a look at the video below. Uh, but the owner wasn't in today, so they didn't, um, they didn't feel comfortable saying yes without her permission. So that's fair enough. But it's not like I haven't filmed in there before. So if you do want to check out The Witch's Moon, um, do have a look below. And they have a website so you can get all these things as well if you want to by mail order. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go and get ready for my interview with Jesse Driscoll. And hopefully I'll see you there. And until next time, go in peace. Namaste and blessed be.